Hello Viplomats, welcome to Edwipla YIS. In this video, we discuss about Global Hunger Index 2020. Recently, there is a news continuously about hunger. World Food Program also got Nobel Peace Prize for working to eradicate hunger. And in India also, during COVID-19, there were efforts to handle hunger and malnutrition in the country. So once again, Global Hunger Index is in news. Let us see what are the issues involved in this and how India fared in it. So this is Hindu news extract. The headline is India fares poorly in hunger index. Let us see in what indicators India is not doing good, in what indicators India is actually doing good. And we will compare with other countries as well. This is the map of global hunger index. This is given by those who are giving the global hunger index every year. As per 2020, if you see the map, this is the alarming, this color indicates alarming condition. This color indicates serious condition. So India is categorized as serious condition with respect to hunger. If you see here, India is comparable only with countries like many African nations and South Asian nations and South America and China and Russia and many Middle East countries also having low condition. Now we will see the rank. This year 107 countries are indicated in the global hunger index now let us see how india is faring in comparing with our south asian nations this is the index india is at 94th rank and many south asian countries are better than us take sri lanka nepal bangladesh myanmar pakistan they are all above India. Only Afghanistan, that is also not very far from India. So the, all these ranks are of 107 countries. This shows the severity of hunger in India. Now we'll see what how index is calculated. There are four indicators. One is undernourishment second child wasting third child stunting fourth child mortality rate now these are the four important these are very important in terms of examination point of view both in prelims and mains in, in mains social justice paper second paper issues related to hunger and poverty can be asked in mains so just remember these four important indicators in calculating global hunger index one is undernourishment this is related to the sufficient food is taken or not calorific intake so that the sufficient energy comes to a child and child mortality is the number of children are dying without food under five under age of five and these two are two varied versions of different kind one is child wasting this means low weight for the height child stunting means low height for the age under 5 these all these are calculated under 5 so some children do not have sufficient weight for their height this is wasting stunting refers to low height for their age now we will see in all these four parameters in which parameter india improved in which parameter india has not yet improved Before that, these are the two organizations which are giving the index. One is Wealth Hunger Life. This is German organization. This means Wealth Hunger Aid. Another one is the Concern Worldwide. This is Ireland organization. These two are involved in giving World Hunger Index. Now, India's performance. This one child stunting child stunting already explained it is low height for the age 
India significantly improved from 54% to 35% from 2000 but it is still very low comparing with many other countries. In child wasting also this, this indicator has not improved for last two decades. It is even rather worse in two decades. So this is low weight for the height child wasting. So these two are very important. So remember child stunting and child wasting. These two are two parameters which India needs to improve a lot. These are related to the nutrition. So this is also called chronic nutrition problem. Chronic nutrition. Chronic, sorry, chronic undernutrition. Acute undernutrition. Sufficient food is available but the required nutrition is not available in the food. And these two indicators themselves constitute about a third of the total score. That's why India's performance indicators are very poor. Only two areas where India improved is undernourishment and child mortality. So now children are dying less. Children are getting food to target public distribution system midday meal scheme and integrated child development scheme food is available children are not dying but the kind of nutrition in the food is not up to the mark so it is giving low weight and low height so these are the low weight to their age low height to their age these are the two areas where india needs to improve so these are various issues involved in global hunger index and how India is performing in this index. And in addition to this one, let us analyze another issue with respect to hunger. Whenever hunger issue comes, we need to remember sustainable development goals. So sustainable development goal, goal number two says zero hunger. Hunger has to be eradicated by 2030. This is the goal of sustainable development goals or United Nation goals, so global goals. At present, 69 crore people are undernourished. So this report says if this kind of progress goes, at least 37 countries will fail even to reach very low hunger index. That means a severity scale. So steps need to be taken more so that sustainable developmental goals can be achieved by 2030. This is the suggestion from the report. So these are various issues. What is global hunger index? Who gives global hunger index? And how India failed? And how the performance of sustainable developmental goals? Thank you students. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel at Viplav IAS. And we will see in the next video. Thank you once again.